As fires in the Boundary Waters continue to grow, crews a few miles from them are doing fire suppression work on homes and cabins. CBS 3's Kendall Jarbo went up the Gunflint Trail and explains what the process is like and why it's so important. Fire suppression efforts are nothing new to residents on the Gunflint Trail. It is a whole industry up here, just making sure that all of our homes and places that we love are safe and can remain that way. Ben Seaton grew up on the Gunflint. He's now a volunteer firefighter, busy at work with his team, preparing for the worst. I think concern is the right word. I don't think that that means we need to be worried at this moment. It is something that is understandably on the front of everybody's mind. It is kind of the game in town right now. However, I think it is important that we all focus our efforts on working together. These crews are doing firewise projects. That means ridding wooded areas near structures of highly flammable materials like balsam fir trees and low lying branches. This is the woods untouched. There's a lot going on in here and it's a lot thicker. Over here on the other side is where crews have already worked through. It's much more thinned out and there's not a lot that the fire could catch. In a major fire, it's not the main fire. It's not the big fire we see that's going to hurt your structure. It's all the embers that come out of it. They'll land on the structure and that's what actually starts it on fire. So if you can do those little things so that little ember can't get started, your house is going to be protected. It's the work that happens before a fire comes that makes all the difference. Lending a helping hand and some heavy machinery to this community near the wilderness. So if anyone can do something for another person, it's kind of what we do up here. We're a very tight knit community. Projects you can do at home to protect your structure from a wildfire include clearing leaves from the roof and gutters, moving firewood piles away from structures, and making sure address posts are visible so first responders can find your home.